this is not a normal cool dude video because it's not what's up everybody this is cool dude and yep my first vlog what's up guys uh yep um probably as you've seen in the title i'm probably gonna put it in there but i'm in new mexico for my uh first vacation trip as i told you in live stream if you guys watched it but look at this we are in a hot hotel near um you know new mexico and um not really going to be doing much um, for the first day because it was mostly driving. We had to drive for eight hours from Arizona to New Mexico. It was crazy, and uh, I just stretched, and uh, yeah, just recording this. It's going to be a little weird, though, because I'm recording on my phone, and it has a weird way of editing. That thing. I just saw that. It looks really cool. But, um, yep. We'll just see how it works, and hope you guys enjoy it because I've never done a vlog before, so it could be fun. So let's get this vlog started. Man, look at this, guys. We haven't gotten our room yet. We're just, ex I'm just exploring around. But look at this. This just looks so nice. Cool beds and everything. There's like a thing. And look at all this. Look at all this. Look at all this. This is so gosh darn beautiful. And those lights. So far, I'm already liking it. That's a cool summer day. But yeah, we're just checking in, but just wanted to explore. Cause you know what? It's good to be adventurous. Little life lesson for you. Be adventurous. Because good things will come to those who are curious and adventurous. Life lesson from Cool Dude on this vlog. But be cool Dude proudly presents a nice upside view of parking lots. Fly away, you darn epic bathroom vlog. Sweet. Yeah, we finally got our room. And this hotel room is absolutely nuts. Like... Well, there's Wi-Fi. This is a yeah. uh, nice hotel. So we can get you guys Wi-Fi. This is very nice. You like it? I'm about to move off to come in here and watch TV. Well, Pretty much. Look at this. We can put the Wi-Fi on here. This is a nice hotel room. It's a lot yeah. different than a lot of the other hotel rooms, like in big cities these days. Which I like it. We like it a lot. And just look at this. There's another bathroom in here. It's like a shower and everything. Get a somewhat good view of the outside there. Look at this. Look at all this. And then, look at this right here. There's something in. This is like one of those storage rooms. <laughs> this is going to be a nice place to stay at. Cool dudes like in New Mexico already. That's right, cowboy. You wrangle those horses. You wrangle them good. You want some chairs? Cool dudes got a cool chair sale going on. Look at all these chairs. Alright, so now... We're pretty much chilling at the hotel. We just ate dinner. If you're wondering why my hair is like this, I just took a shower. So, um, yeah, we're just chilling here and pretty much about to hit the hay right now. So, yeah, it's going to be the end of day one. And, um, well, by the time you're watching this, by the time I record this, it's going to be, uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow. But, again, it's for me, not for you guys, obviously, because this is going to be a vlog video. So, yep, day one's over, and I'll see you guys at day two. Pretty much after this clip right now. Day two of the vlog, guys. By the time you're watching this, anyway, it's just gonna be a clip, but. Yeah, we're heading out to this place called Meow Wolf, which, uh, I've just seen pictures of, but it looks real cool. You guys will see it, so. Yeah, let's do this. Yeah, look at this! It's the Iron Giant! The Iron Giant's like twin brother of the flower. That is amazing. Doesn't that look cool, guys? Alright, so we're here at Meow Wolf, and this place is packed. Just look at this. Look at all the cars that are here. Look at all the cars that are here right now. It's nuts out here. I'm standing next to this giant robot though. Sweetness. There's also a giant wolf and a giant spider nearby. Like, right, right over there. Look at this gigantic thing. Hey mommy, it's old yeller. It's a lot bigger than I remember. And, there's the giant spider I was talking about. That one's cool too. It looks like it's made out of wires or something. I haven't even gone inside yet, but I'm already liking it. We're gonna have to wait a while because it's packed, but yeah, we're reserving for a time right now. But, once we get inside, I'll be able to get the camera on for you guys to see it, because it's supposed to be really cool. It's like, it's like all lit up and you can go inside like washing machines it's just it's nuts and you guys are gonna like it so see so you guys are there we made it inside guys 
Look at this. This is so cool. I, I, I don't know if you can hear me. The music's kind of loud, but we're in. I don't know if I'm going to be able to record all this, guys, but I'll record the best moments. Here we go, the journey begins. Oh, there's a clue right here, guys. There's supposed to be an underlying story behind all this, so it'll be interesting to see what's going on here. Uh, mommy, what did you do to the ceiling? This is so weird. This is so weird. Hello, Grandma. Nice to see you. Yeah, nice, nice. Absolutely nice. Oh, my God. You're entering a room here with Christmas lights. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Going into doors to other dimensions. Look at all this freaking stuff. It is so freaking insane. This is really cool. Hold your horses, guys. There's a man trapped in there. Don't worry, we'll get you out of there. Just hang on. I don't know how we're gonna get down the toilet. Uh, good old fashioned piano. This is like, like, look at this. I, um, literally... This closet right here, this closet right there, guys, leads to another dimension. It's like everything that you go here can lead to another freaking dimension. Like, look at that. The stairs lead to another dimension. This leads to another dimension. Everything's a dimension. It's so rad. And All around me are familiar lights. Oh, God, I'm just, I have to crouch down so many times doing this. Oh, God. Oh, cool, dude, I can't handle Oh, God. Guys, we're going inside the washer. I used to always get to my clothes on these things, but it's kind of hard to get in, though, because it's like a... There we go. Oh, my God. Oh, this is so cool. Look at that. What the heck is that? All the clothes are like frozen in midair. There's like lights. It's so cool. Oh, oh. Watch this. this oh my god. That was awesome. This place is cool. And now we're in a tree house. It's just, what, what is happening? Why is this happening? Oh, we are inside the chimney right now. What's the matter, Yevon? Your chimney doesn't look like this? Blasphemy. Everybody knows this is what chimneys look like. On the inside. <laughs> if you don't know, if you didn't know that, now you know. Hey, you. You look like a trustworthy dude. Do you know a way out of this weird color forest? Oh, you're giving me the silent treatment, aren't you? You give me the silent treatment? Answer me, ma. Answer me, man. <sighs> Fine. You know what? I'm just gonna leave you. Stay there then. See if I can. Oh, look at this, an ordinary fridge. Let me just open this real quick. What the heck is this? Oh, no. I, uh... I seem to have... I, uh... What the heck is going on here? Let me see here. Where are we? We're in Bermuda. Wow. Look at this. Portal of Bermuda. Your gateway to the multiverse. Where's my Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy? No one's gonna understand that reference. This is cool, it's like a looks like a spaceport almost. Wow. I don't know where to go, guys. Guess we'll just head on out. This is cool though. You guys, I I, I know I keep repeating myself, I'm so sorry, but to actually like see all this creative stuff. Is like really cool and it's also super bizarre. And like, look at this here. Who in their right mind would ever think of this stuff? Hey guys, look, cool dude's a bird now. That's why I'm in this little bird house here. Get out of here, you bird. Talk about the worst place to stay ever. Look at this room. There's like a giant spider with an ant right here. There is literally a freaking frog in there. There's a tongue in the sink, and there's a freaking demon lady in there. I am not staying here. I, I don't. I don't care if it looks like Cuphead. No, I am not. I'm, I'm not going to afford any of this. This is a rip. Guys, this is a diabetes summed up in one room. Look at this, guys. It's Cuphead. I found, like, a... We're in, like, a, an arcade cabinet. 
look at this. There's like retro games and everything on it. Street Fighter, Marvel's Capcom 2. This is nice. Some of the stuff you have to pay for like that, but most of this is free. I'm like, we can play this for free. Granted, I like the Xbox One version better, but you know, who am I to judge? Sweetness. I'm gonna go ahead and play on this for a while. What's up, guys? So, yeah. I just finished Meow Wolf, and that was amazing. You guys, I, I couldn't even show all of it. Like, there was so, so much more to that. It was so cool. Like, there was clues hidden everywhere about the story behind it all, and it, it had some cool imagery, creative imagery. I showed you a little bit, but there's just so much more behind it. And I even picked myself up this cool shirt right here. House of Eternal Return. It shows some of the stuff that I saw during the uh, trip through Meow Wolf, and that was awesome. And if any of you go to Santa Fe, I would absolutely recommend going to Meow Wolf. It is amazing and worth worth the trip. Yeah, I had a lot of fun. It was a blast. Milk chocolate and Reese's Pieces say what? Yeah, back at the hotel room after that amazing, and I'm doing an amazing Meow Wolf experience. And I'm about to devour this. I actually have had this before. It's actually not that bad. It's pretty good. But it's time to eat this sugary goodness. Yeah. Alright, so it is day three of our trip to Santa Fe. And we are going to be exploring more of the plaza today. Look at it. It looks so nice. But yeah, before we go to the plaza, we're going to go to a few museums. An art museum, which of course I will show footage of. Of course, for you awesome, beautiful people. And uh, yep, let's do it. Here we are, guys. The New Mexico Museum of Art. See you guys. And here, as Bob Ross would put it, we have some nice, happy little trees. This is nice artwork, isn't it? Man, Bob Ross would really be impressed with these pieces of artwork. At least I think so. And here you can see the predator stalking its prey. It's pretty nothing like going down the road in your good old-fashioned car, am I right, guys? This is the face you make when you realize you have a big test at school and you didn't study at all the previous time. This sculpture is absolutely nuts. This one's called Cherry Bomb. That's 23 karat gold on the top of that. That is... Ain't, ain't that awesome, guys? So, up, y'all? So, yeah, we just finished, um, the... New Mexico Museum of Art, and that was cool. Like, there's a lot of great artwork in there. And again, I couldn't show all of it. And um, I'm sorry if I couldn't talk through a lot of it, just because I want to get the remain quiet throughout this particular museum. But we had a lot. I, I, I think I had a lot of fun. So we are off to the their history museum. So uh, yeah, I'll see you guys there. So, I just finished the New Mexico Museum of History, and it was very, very, very extensive. It talked a lot about the overview. Like, it talked a lot about everything of New Mexico, like their war, the wars that they were in, 
uh, some of the ties with the U.S., some of the ties with the other states, and they're just their state founding in general, all that good stuff. And I thought that was really neat and very interesting to learn about. And I, I liked it. It was very, very interesting. But anyway, we're going to go out to the plaza, and yeah, I'll see you guys. Ho, ho, ho. Get out of here, you creepy-looking Santa. It's not even Christmas here. And here we are, back outside. It's pretty cool how this place functions. It's like every, everything's in Adobe, connected to one another. It's new, and I like it. And we're here. The Santa Fe Plaza looks really nice. There's like a big old statue over there. It's pretty cool. And there's a bunch of in recognition, like little benches here. So it's pretty cool up in here. If you take a look very closely, you will see that there's a neat looking statue behind me. Isn't that neat looking? I think it's pretty neat. The Chuck Jones Studio Gallery. We have reached our destination. So check this out, guys. I'm about to pick myself up this rad blue and red Santa Fe shirt. Got the cool flag symbol and Santa Fe, established in 1610. Alrighty, it is day four of our trip here in New Mexico. And yeah, it's the last day. The last full day, anyway, of here, us here in New Mexico. And we're, we're going to be just exploring around a couple shops and... Uh, Go to different restaurants and all that stuff. Just gonna be hanging around New Mexico and all that stuff. Except we're not gonna be walking around, we're gonna be driving in our car. So let's go be sweet. Alright, we are heading to the Poet Cultural Center right here. It's this large adobe right here. It's supposed to be really cool. Native Americans built this pretty cool, right? We're about to enter this dark cave right here. Wish me luck. I might not be back. We just finished the museum. It's pretty neat. In the cave, once once you enter, there's like a full-on display of like all their history, all the natives' history. It was really cool. It's super neat. There's like mini, there's like little mini statues, and it's t basically in um in just dioramas and all that. It tells you the history of the natives, which is cool. It was very interesting. Hold your horses, guys. There's a camel right there. Do you see it? It's made out of rock. This place is called Camel Rock, because this particular rock structure right there looks like a camel head. That's a big old hump for the hill. And there's actually a path right here that where you can actually like walk up to it and see it like a lot closer. That that's a pretty neat. That's pretty neato. Look at that thing. The camel. What are you doing all the way out here? Sweet. It doesn't, it doesn't matter, Camel Rock. You do you. You are amazing. You just do you. We are off to the International Folk Art Museum. But you know what? You just stay right there, bro. It was nice meeting you. Here we are, International Folk Art. You can see it right there on that banner. So. Look at all those masks. Now this one, in my opinion, is a cool one. It's very weird looking, admittedly, but it's very cool. And there's a bunch of robots over here. Fight it out, boy. Guys, this museum is lit. There's so much to do around here. It's huge. It's like, we can't even do everything today, which is kind of sucks, but it's so cool. There's such a variety of different things. It's literally from every other nation. There's so much to learn, look at, and see. There's so much variety in the art, and uh, I think it's my favorite art museum to date right now here in New Mexico. It is such a, so amazing. Ladies and gentlemen, whatever you do, do not mess with this man. He could literally step on you. He could bite you in the ankle. You see this right here, guys? This is the San Miguel Church. And fun fact about this church, it is the oldest church in U.S. history. Crazy, right, guys? I, th I found that nuts when I first heard about it. That's, that's insane. 
It's very, it's very fascinating though. What's up, y'all? If you notice my new hat, I think it is so cool. Yeah, I just got it at a store before we headed here back to the hotel. Guess it's Santa Fe, New Mexico, right there. And it's black and yellow, black and yellow. <laughs> yeah, I already know people are going to throw out that joke. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much going to wrap it up for this vlog, guys. Because, uh, yeah, after right now, at this point, um, we're just going to be getting dinner. I'm probably going to bed. And then, yeah, we're off back to Arizona. So, yeah, for the most part, I love New Mexico. New Mexico was amazing. There was so many things to do. And I just, I loved the food. loved the, um, all the sites you got to see. The museums were really neat. And uh, hopefully it made for a good vlog. I don't really know. This is my first vlog, and I'm really hyped to see how you guys, uh, w what you guys think about this, and uh, if I should do more. Let me know down in the comments section below. But uh, yeah, I had a lot of fun uh, in New Mexico, and I had even more fun recording this for you guys. But yeah, until the next video, because pretty much by the time I upload this, yeah, I'm probably gonna just still be in Arizona. But until next time, guys, stay cool, and I will see you in the next video. Bye bye, guys.